What's going on guys here for another bottle digging video um, <laughs> I just dug uh, two nights ago but the digging was actually pretty good so even though it is currently whew, 102 degrees over here in Texas I am headed to do a little bit more bottle digging I just left work just a little bit ago and in the DFW area I'm heading out to my dump don't have a whole lot of time to dig tonight uh, it's already 5.15, but uh, y'all just hang out with me for a little bit, and we'll hopefully we can get a few bottles dug tonight. Hopefully, we can get something good. I'd like to get a nice soda. The last video y'all saw, I dug half of a Farmersville uh, Liberty Bottling Works from Farmersville. I sure would like to get a whole one. So, y'all just hang tight. Let's see what we can find. Appreciate it, guys. All right, guys. I've got a couple... Just unembossed little medicines. One's a screw top and one's a little cork top. They're not embossed with anything. This one's got the numbers on it. But I've got some kind of amber bottle down here and it has embossing on it. It's square paneled. I'm not sure what it is yet. It's pretty big. <sighs> I don't dig a lot of embossed amber stuff. So, and it's in there pretty solid. It feels like it's going to be whole. So y'all just hang out with me. Let's see what this is going to be. I'm going to turn the camera off and I'll be back. Alright guys. Well, here it is. <laughs> it was already broken in the ground. Well, that's a shame. It was almost completely there. Corked up. Smells horrific inside there. It was a Grover's Imperial Main Remedy, which I've seen them before, but that would have been a new one on me. God, it smells. Here's a cool find. This is a Coca-Cola from Sherman, Texas. I'm pretty sure that's a pretty good bottle. Uh, it's a... I've got the date in here a second ago, and I can't remember. It was in 20-something. 20, 20, there it is. There's a 24. So 24, 1924, so this would have been a 1915 Pat date Coke from Sherman. It's a pretty good bottle. So, anyways, guys, keep doing a little bit more digging. Appreciate y'all watching. All right, guys, got a couple things to show y'all. Found this little thing a second ago. It's glass. I'm not 100% sure what it is. I was going to take it home and clean it up. Then I moved locations. And I got this over here, and it's embossed. Something Massachusetts, I think. I got no idea what it is. It looks like it's Massachusetts. <laughs> I don't know what it is, guys. I'm gonna pull it out, see if I can get the camera. Well, I don't think I can get the camera to stay still. See, I do this one-handed, very carefully one-handed. I don't even know if this thing is whole, or if it is whole, I don't even know what it is. Here it comes, I think, yeah, it's about ready to come out. <laughs> what in the world? What is this? J.F. Howard um, Haver, Haver Hill, Massachusetts Some kind of food jar or something huh. I don't know what that is Never dug one of those before Probably something common I would imagine 
Never seen one. I'm gonna keep on digging, guys. All right, guys. Only thing else I pulled out was this little Carter's ink. It's not gonna go home with me, so <laughs> I'm about done digging for the night. I didn't have a whole lot of time to dig. This is gonna be <laughs> probably a, the best find of the day, although it's, I don't know what it is. Some sort of a condiment jar or something, food jar. I don't know. Y'all tell me in the comments. J.F. Howard, Haverhill, Massachusetts. Nothing on the base. It's pretty cool. It's got cool embossing on it. But I'm going to find out what this is, take it home. I'm going to keep looking around a little bit longer. I'm just going to kind of walk around. Look in some of the holes I've dug and then I'm going to walk out of here. So, short, short video today, guys. Not much to be found, but I appreciate y'all watching. And y'all hang out for the next video. I'm fixing to start building me a little shed on my property that I bought in East Texas. So, that's going to start next week. So, <clears throat> y'all just uh, hang tight for the next video. I appreciate y'all coming along for the trip. Thanks, guys.